Good morning class. This is Mamado. Welcome to Mamado Classroom. Our lesson for today is about rounding decimal numbers to the nearest hundreds and thousands. Okay, what are the rules in rounding up decimal numbers? 1. To round decimal, look at the digit to the right of the digit to be rounded. 2. If the digit is 5 or more, round up then. Add 1 to the digit in the rounding place and drop all digit to its right. 3. If the digit is 4 or less, round down. Just drop all digit to the right of the digit in the rounding place. So remember that rule. If the digit is 5 or more, round up. Then add 1 to the digit in the rounding place and drop all the digit to its right. Okay, class? And another one, if the digit is 4 or less, what are we going to do? Round down. Then just drop all the digit to the right of the digit in the rounding place. Is that clear? Okay, class, we're going to use number 9 to round 3 and 87 hundreds to the nearest tenth. So, using number 9, we have 3 and 6 tenths, then 3 and 7 tenths, 3 and 8 tenths, and 3 and 9 tenths. So, we're going to round this up to the nearest ten. So, let us see. So, we have yes, 3 and 87 hundreds is much closer to 3 and 9 tenths. So, we need to round up 3 and 87 to 3 and 9 tenths. Or in short, the number 3 and 87, the number beside 8 is 7. So the rule is 5 up, round up. So plus 1. So this one will become 3 and 9 tenths. That is the answer. Okay, another one. Use a number line to round 875 thousands to the nearest hundred. So we have, have here this tens, this one is hundreds, and this five is thousands. So let us see, let us round this to the nearest hundreds by using this number line. So we have 86 hundreds. This one is 87 hundreds. This one is 88 hundreds. Then 89 hundreds. So let us see. So we have 87, 87 hundreds. The decimal 875 thousands is between 87 hundreds and 8800 so the decimal 875000 round up to 8800 okay so another one use a number line to round 4752 10000s to the nearest thousands so let us see so this one is tens, hundred, thousand, ten thousand. So thousand, this one is thousand, five is the thousand place. So we have here 
So we have the decimal 4,752, 10,000 is closer to 475,000 than 476,000. So the decimal that to be round up to the nearest thousand is for 4,752, 10,000 is to be round down to 475,000. Okay, we're going to round off 89 and 85,658 100,000 to the nearest hundreds. This one is the tenth place. This one is the hundredth place. Okay, so what is the number beside 5, 6? So the rule, 5 up plus 1. So 5, we're going to add five, 1 and 5. So the answer is 89 and 8600. Correct. Next. We need to round it up to the nearest ones. So the ones place is 89. Beside 89 is 8. So 5 up, round up. So 89 plus 1 is 90. Correct. Next, round up to the nearest tenth. Where is the tenth place? This one, 8 is the 10th place. So what is the number beside 8? It's 5. So 5 up plus 1. So 8 plus 1, this will become 9. So the answer is 89 and 9 tenths. Correct. Next, number 4. Thousands. So where's the thousand place? So tens, hundred. Thousand. So six is on the thousand place. What is the number beside six? Five. So five up, round up. So plus one. So six will become seven. So the answer is eighty nine and eight hundred fifty seven thousands. Next. Number five, we have 10,000. So where's the 10,000 place here? This one is 10, 100,000, 10,000. The 10,000 place is five. What is the number beside five? Eight. So eight, five up, round, off. So what are we going to do with five plus one? So the answer is 89. And 8,566, 10,000. Very good. Correct. Okay, class, I want you to try this. Round up the following numbers to the place value of the underlying digit. So I will give you time to think and solve the problem. Your time starts now. Okay, let us check your answer. So, let us see. We're going to round off 9. So, the number beside 9 is 2. So, we need to follow the rule. This is 4 and below. So, we are going to round down. So, the answer is 8 and 839. Thousands. Very good. Next. So the number it's underlined is three. Is this is the hundred place? Hundred place. So the number beside three is eight. So five up, round up, plus one. 
So this one, three, we're going to add one on three. So the answer is five and four hundredths. Very good. Next, we have 75. And five is the one that is underlined. This is the one's place. So what is the number beside five? It is nine. Of course, five up plus one. So five will become six. This is the answer. Seventy-six. Very good. So number one, number five. We have nine and four hundred eighty-five. The underlying number is on the hundred hundred place, and this is eight. The number beside eight is five. So five up round. Oh, very good. So, what are we going to do with 8? We're going to add 1. So, this will become 9 and 49 hundredths. Very good. Last number. 62 and 5,846 ten thousands. The underlined digit is 4. What is the number beside 4? 6. 6. So, 5 up. Round. Oh, very good. So, we're going to add 1 on 4. So, this will become 62 and 585,000. Very good. Okay, class. I want you to keep in mind the rules in rounding up decimal numbers. 1. To round decimal, look at the digit to the right of the digit to be rounded. Second, if the digit is 5 or more, round up, then add 1 to the digit in the rounding place and drop all the digit to its right. Third, if the digit is 5 or less, round down. Just drop all the digits to the right of the digit in the rounding place. Okay class, I hope you learned something today. This is Mama Do. See you on our next lesson. Thank you. Bye.